Why has war and terrorism engulf Middle East states and how can peace and security be achieved? The three wars of Syria, Iraq and Yemen have left millions killed, wounded and maimed, with more than 20 million displaced. This is the worst humanitarian disaster since World War II. Where and how did this catastrophe begin? Following the rise of Khomeini's dictatorship in Iran, he established the Revolutionary Guards in 1979 to maintain his power. The IRGC's mission has been to quell the Iranian people, interfere in other countries, and export terrorism under the banner of Islamic Revolution. Today, the IRGC receives its orders directly from Supreme Leader Ali Khamenei. IRGC, 38 years of crimes, war, and terror. Crackdown and killings inside Iran, especially oppressing the 2009 uprising and killings targeting the opposition abroad, including massacring members of the People's Mujahideen Organization of Iran in Iraq. Warmongering and war crimes in Iraq, Syria, Yemen, and Lebanon, in addition to eight years of war between Iran and Iraq and establishing proxy militia groups. Active connection with terrorist groups including Al-Qaeda and the Taliban and playing a role in the growth and expansion of ISIS. Terrorists meddling in at least 10 other Middle East countries including Bahrain, Egypt, Palestine, Jordan, Afghanistan, Saudi Arabia, Turkey, the UAE, Kuwait and Qatar and dozens of other countries across the globe. Measures aimed at obtaining nuclear weapons, ballistic missiles, and launching cyber attacks. Controlling Iran's economy to provide necessary funding for terrorism. Now is the time to end the appeasement policy vis-a-vis -vis criminals and implement justice. Only solution to reach peace and tranquility in the region. UN, US, EU and Middle East countries designating the IRGC as a terrorist organization, imposing comprehensive sanctions and evicting the IRGC from all regional countries, especially Syria, Iraq, Yemen and Lebanon. 